Beamer Merchant again. This is the uh, second part of a video that we're uh, we're doing, where we're comparing the differences in terms of wiring harnesses between the M54 engines. You know, either a 5 series uh, E39 or a 3 series E46. As we all know, they're the same motors: 525, 325, or 330, 530. Same motors. Only differences is the wiring a schematic. Or how the wiring is set up and that's what we're gonna show you uh, in this video in the previous video we went ahead and basically showed you the differences in terms of the headers 5 series compares to a uh, uh, 3 series we also went ahead and focused on the wiring that controls most of these functions here throttle body starter and so forth where it was the same on the 525 had the same connection as the one in those connections were the same okay um, this is engines from an X5 3.0 525 02 and this connection was from an 02 325 completely different okay now we move along and we actually focus on the wiring harness that attaches to the DME and the transmission on the 5 series models this wiring harness is connected it's actually found underneath this uh, air vent on the passenger side. If you remove this, you're going to find all the wiring under here on the passenger side. On the E46 3 Series, the wiring is found on the driver's side front. As you can see right here, that's the transmission and that is the DME or the brain for the computer right here. Differences. See how it goes from here to here and so forth. So we'll be talking about this. In this video okay so this is the wiring harness for the 5 series usually the blue connections connect to the transmission and I'm not gonna go ahead and explain where each connection goes to hopefully you can figure that out okay we're just doing a quick overview here this connection compared to this 3.0 x5 engine this right here we compared them and they're about they have the similar connections you know where this blue one here is down there somewhere the relays are the same so yeah these are the same now let's go through a E46 engine okay the E46 uh, wiring to the DME transmission get a little bit more confusing especially with this engine because it was a manual uh, it is gonna have less wires because uh, it didn't have a transmission uh, transmission computer so but most E46 it's a whole separate wire you see that right there and then pretty much these connections are for the um, all two sensors all the connections for the backup light somewhere here right here transmission backup light now I'm guessing if this was a, an automatic uh, engine automatic it would also have wires for the transmission computer which it doesn't but as you can see the E46 has different wiring harnesses this one's removable completely removable here same thing here the one that goes to the side is a little bit different okay so those are the uh, differences uh, what this information is gonna help you um, or is gonna help you when you want to go ahead and for example again buy a, an engine from a 525 and let's say you have a 325 you'll know already offhand that you're you're not going to be able to do a straight swap you know you can just go ahead and put in the engine from a 3 series to your 5 series you're going to have to go ahead and change the uh, wiring schematics so make sure you get uh, the wiring um, information here so again, there's a 5 Series and X5 3.0 models have about the, the, the same uh, plugs in terms of uh, in their wiring harness. The only difference is, the, is this E46 model. Um, later on, we're going to go ahead and pull out an engine out of a O2 325 CI automatic. And we're going to go ahead and compare the differences with this manual transmission versus an automatic transmission. As for now, um, hopefully this video is going to provide you more insights or educate you in terms of what the uh, difference is with the engines.
from a 5 series uh, X5 model or an E46. If you have any questions, comments, or if you're looking for any of these motors, go ahead and check out our, our websites and you should see them there. If you don't see them, contact me directly and I'll definitely go ahead and help you uh, find one. Okay, again, this is Beamer Merchant. Thanks so much for watching. You have a great day.